Hello, welcome to my channel, Connection of Lives and Infants. This is Sharon coming to you with a pizza kit from Little Caesars. My mother-in-law ordered a kit for a fundraiser. We had two, they come in a package of two. Uh, we had four total and we had two when she was here and now we're having two more just missed your thumbs up and I welcome to the channel all those that are my lifers and those that have just joined my channel welcome I have something for everybody and cooking recipes is a little bit on my channel not a whole lot but i do have a variety we have old cars we have building with pallets we have gardening painting pours and be on the lookout because i'm going to be doing some diamond painting but there's something new that i just started and i'm very excited and it involves all of you so I need you all to comment on my short video, which is called Channel Shoutouts, and they are coloring pages. And what I'm doing is I am coloring theme pictures from an app that are very fitting to my YouTube friends. So, if you would like to have a unique channel shout out, then I suggest you go to my short coloring videos that say channel shout out and it's hashtag uh, coloring with friends 2024. It's an open collab hosted by two people that I don't remember who they are because they switched who does the hosting of these. One was Grandma Sandy. Hi, Grandma Sandy. There's a shout out there on this cooking video. And what I ask you to do is comment what kind of coloring page you would like to see for your channel shout out. Now, I've actually started some channel shout outs with my shorts without people knowing that that's what I was starting to do. Because, you know, there's people that are into gardening, so I'll do gardening. There's people into music, so I'll do music. But if I haven't shouted you out, and I, I have got a lot unlisted. Uh, so some people I've already done their videos, they just don't know it yet because it's not posted. But, I want to hear from you what kind of coloring page you want. What they have all kinds and I have been trying to find a flag. Hi Judy Mae Collins. Anybody that knows Judy Mae Collins and I'll put the shout out names that I call in this video in the description below. Please go and check these people out because they're awesome supporters. You know if you know her, she loves everything patriotic. So I've been trying to find a flag, but I haven't been able to. But I have been filming flags on the side of the road when we're traveling. And I share that with her and give her a shout out. So with this kit, you get the sauce, of course the dough, and a package of cheese, and each pizza has its own individual package for the sauce and the cheese. And then it's got pepperoni that you need to share between the two pizzas. And then you add whatever toppings you want on top of that. So I already have one in the oven and I have the timer set and it takes seven to nine minutes to cook. And <laughs> I told you the timer was set. And I don't think that that time is right. 
you know, sometimes the old fashioned timers, cause yeah, I used my phone one too. So, you know, relax, but I still can't help but use the old fashioned timers like you just heard. And I like to turn my stuff around when it's cooking so it cooks evenly, whether it be in an oven or a toaster oven or what have you. But because these pizzas are on a rack and they're big, they're hard to handle. So I'm not turning it around. I'm just hoping for the best. And I think the last time when we had it, it was, it was fine. So yay. So do you have a method of your madness of doing your toppings on your pizza? Do you, do you do it like this and then you go like that or you just throw it on and spread it with your hand? Comment below what your methods are. I figure because the oven is either preheating or cooking the pizza before this one that I just take my time adding the toppings. So I am going to add on top of this sliced onions and, oh, um, what are they? The uh, banana peppers. How many of you like banana peppers? We do. And I've got two pizza pans. You cook it on the rack, but I like to use this big pizza pan for decorating because that's what we're doing. We're artists here. Decorating our pizza before it's cooked. And I like to do it on the bigger pan. The other pan I have is smaller and I'll use that one, I think anyway, <laughs> because this one's taken, to take the other pizza and put it on the smaller one. I just feel like it's easier to slide this off a bigger one. I don't know, but I could be proven wrong. So there you go. And how many of you, when you watch cooking videos where people are like putting stuff on, do you go, oh, you watch for the bare spots and you go, oh, put it there, put it there, put it there. And you hope that they do. I do. I, I have fun doing that. And <clears throat> excuse me, I don't know. I just guesstimated on the pepperonis. I don't divide them equally by counting them out. How many of you would count them out? And what is your, I, I like to put the one in the middle and then do the ones on the outside. And last time when my mother-in-law was here, we added green bell peppers that I had in the freezer. I know some of you are going, ew, gross, in the freezer. Yeah, in the freezer, it works. You know why? If you get frozen pizzas at the stores, guess what? All the toppings are frozen, right? So there you have it. And according to how this is going, the pepperonis have not been shared equally, but it's still okay. There's a pepperoni in every bite. Okay, so. Pepperonis are really slimy. Alright, so I'm gonna chop up some onions and add the banana peppers. Get this one out and get this one in and that's what we're having for supper tonight. And do you say supper or do you say sin sinner? <laughs> dinner. <laughs> I hope you give me a thumbs up if you like this video and you join my channel if you haven't yet. Like I said, I got something for everybody and I do unboxings. And ring that bell so you don't miss any upcoming notifications. Be kind, be nice, be encouraging no matter where you are through the internet. We can touch lives. We can make a difference. We can make people smile, laugh, and give encouraging words. And remember, Keep the fun in all you do. And I have to say, I love my silicone 
Thanks for taking out hot things. How about you? They're flexible. Not all of them are. Thanks for watching. Bye.